Ladies and gentlemen, my name's Lutterfella, and I'm back from China, back to making videos, back to America, and I'm trying the webcam out today, so let me know what you guys think of the webcam. I've had it for a while, and when I first started making these videos, I was kind of nervous, I didn't want to use it, I didn't really like it, so it just kind of been sitting up on my computer, but I figured, I think it was time to upgrade, start making a little bit higher quality videos, so... Now you guys can see what I look like and look at my wonderful face and awesome reactions. So, and watch me drink my sparkling ice water. So today we're doing Tavern Brawl. You pick two cards and your entire deck are those two cards. And I recorded a video on this earlier today, but you know me, I messed up, lost the video, so we're doing it again. So basically this deck is Innerve and Yog saran and you innervate him out and you get some really awesome combos and I had some amazing plays but I always get amazing plays with him so I'm not worried um, also I just started my new patreon patron page oh two four six seven two four six well seven eight met. start a new patron page so you guys can donate money to me if you like what I'm doing um, you know help me pay for rent buy food live because I'm college and I don't have much money two four six seven eight and it'd be awesome like think about it like buying a nice cup of coffee you just don't get the coffee and you don't get the cup but you get to give me money so it's really quite similar to buying coffee but yeah link's gonna be in the video description also on my youtube channel homepage if you're interested check it out there's also a reward for the thousand dollar tier <laughs> do it you get a free shirt five seven nine ten all right first yog Let's see what we get. Wow. All right. Incredible. Okay, that was not one of the better combos I've had in my days, but... You know, at least we get to kill this guy next turn. And if he attacks, he also takes our secret out, so... Frankly, that was one of the worst I've ever seen. So, yeah, back from China... I'm like seriously feeling the jet lag right now. I'm so tired. It's only 11 a.m. And that's how you win. So, you know, you spook him. He saw that and he's like, I can't take it. And we won. Best combo ever. But yeah, 36 hours. That's how long my Saturday was. Because China is 12 hours behind us. So when I flew back to America, I gained 12 hours. So, like, it was the longest day ever. I mean, 12 hour flight. Six hour layover, three hour long, another three hour flight, another two hour layover, like just unbelievable. But I'm glad to be back, you know. China's pretty cool. They have some weird food. I actually got sick from eating it at one point, I had to go to the ER, ate some chicken foot. Like, chicken foot actually includes the nails, the skin. That's what grossed me out the most. They had the skin on it. Like, who eats that? I did. But, yeah. Went to the hospital, got some weird Chinese tea. They actually prescribed me tea at the hospital. And it helped me feel better, but I ended up missing two days of my trip. Oh, we're getting a turn one yog. Three, five, seven, nine, ten, yog. Yes, yes, that's a good card. There we go. Do one damage someone to one of them mastiff. Alright. Oh. In the light's name. It was there, man. It was there. It almost worked. Well, at least at least we have a mastiff now. And a light warden, so you know. That's pretty cool. Start my new job this Wednesday. Pretty excited. It is at a pharmaceutical company. And I don't know what my hours are. I don't know what my dress is. I, like, I don't know if it's like a, a uniform or if I'm wearing like casual dress clothes. I don't know. Let's see. We're just going to clear that. I'm not about to let her get a bunch of free spells cast on me. We got this Mastiff next turn. Big plays coming. Man, that... That Yogg probably could have won the game very early 
if he didn't return himself to my hand. That's okay. We have the Mastiff. So if you guys like the webcam, if you think it adds to it, seeing my beautiful face on here, I think it makes it more fun, let me know in the comments, because like, I don't know, I'm still trying to find out what works best for my videos. Um, trying to improve on all of them, so I'm really listening for feedback from all of you. So if you like it, let me know, and if you don't like it, I don't know. I hope you do like it, though. <laughs> and hopefully you can't tell that I'm unbelievably tired. I'm going off of what, maybe... Four hours of sleep in 42 hours. It's just really hard. This morning I woke up at like 6 a.m. and could not get back to sleep because I'm. I mean, that's like 6 p.m. from where I'm from. Oh! That's a sweet. That's a sweet deck. That's a really sweet deck. So many yogs, no nervates. Wow. That's a sweet deck. You see some really cool ones in this game mode. I like it a lot. Get the eyeball off of here. Like Alright, let's see what we got here. Another. That's amazing. I bet that's a fun one to play. <laughs> that costs one spell. He's gonna destroy me. No, we have Yogg. Who knows what can happen with Yogg. Ooh. We need an Innervate and a s 6. Yeah, if I get an Innervate, I can play Yogg. That'll be cool. That is if I survive that long. What a cool deck. That's cooler than the Yogg deck. Wow. I'm not even gonna draw an innervate. I'm gonna get another Yogg. Yep. I can see. Well, we lost that one pretty bad, but we spooked the first guy and got a victory. Let's see if we can get a combo. That's all I need. Round three. We'll see if we can get a cool Yogg combo in here. I must protect the wild. So, my professor, the one who went with us to the Chinese trip, we were there for. Uh, basically research on air pollution and sustainability in urban environments kind of like Beijing's creating a super mega city with some surrounding cities it's going to propose some new issues and we were looking at that so the professor we're with is like kind of one of those old ladies like you're one of your friends might have a grandma like her just kind of she talks a lot about things that really are irrelevant in every situation but you got to listen anyway kind of like my grandma every time she sees me she explains in detail how wombats poop squares. It's kind of cool, I guess. Her bank password is square poop. Her pin number is square poop. Everything, two, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Everything she does is about wombats and square poop. And I think everyone knows someone like that. This is what my professor's like. Just kind of real awkward to be around. Real grandma -y. One of the square poop wombat types. And so we go out into the ghetto. The ghetto in Beijing is extremely creepy. There we go. Wombo combo. It's extremely creepy, and there's like giant dogs the size of small horses behind every single home. Are you kidding me? And one of the dogs is like the size of our foot. The smallest dog there. The least intimidating dog. And our professor screams and runs away like a little girl from this tiny dog, yet she faces the dogs that are the size of a small child or a small home. She just walks up to them like they're nothing. Apparently, the small dog is called an oof dog in China. That's O-O-F. And they're extremely dangerous and might carry rabies and stuff. So we see this oof dog and just sprint through the ghetto. And it was just one of the weirdest things I'd ever done my entire life. I thought it was, it was pretty funny at the time, and then every time we saw a dog or any kind of animal, it was then an oof animal. Oof pig, oof dog, oof chicken. But yeah, that's like, you know, one of those things that your old people do. Like, I don't think oof dog is actually a normal name in China. We're getting wrecked again. These decks are too good. I 
That's five damage per turn. Three, two, four. No, that's more than five. That's a lot. Okay. I guess I lost. Hmm, maybe we should change it up. Maybe the Enerve Yaw combo isn't what we thought it would be. What's the good kind of deck? Warrior, Paladin, Hunter, Priest. And then we'll take their deck, right? We'll do take that card and then um, take more of their cards. What else do I have that steals cards? Thought Steel, Shadow Madness. Um, let's do a Mind Vision Thought Steel. But is that really good? Maybe just one Mind Vision. And then we'll add. I don't know. A Light Well? Oh, we could do. Maybe Light Well with. Um, changes attack to its health. That could be really good. I mean, that's three mana for a 5-5. Five, five. We could get a lot of them out there. I don't know. I just invented it. I've never seen this one. We'll see how it works. We'll see. It feels good to be back and have American food. Not that I don't like the Chinese food, but they have way too much rice and not enough sugar. Not that I really eat sugar here anyway, but like... You go to eat something that you're like, oh, this is very clearly sugar, and it's just never sugar. The, the, nothing they eat tastes sugary. It's just bread. Like, it'll be dessert, and their dessert is just a piece of bread with meat in it. That's not dessert. That's like a savory Thanksgiving meal, you know? I don't know. This is the kind of stuff I think about when I have no sleep. I hope this deck works. I think it's a pretty decent idea. They'll like infinitely heal each other too if we can get a good amount of them out. Should I coin it? Coin it out to it and then another. Yeah. Greetings. Say greetings. Greetings, friend. Okay, thank you. Um, I don't know if it'd be better to play a second light well. Maybe we just play a second, get it out there. And then we'll just like turn them all into five fives out of nowhere and I'll be like, what? While I was in China, we um, ended up visiting the Great Wall, the Forbidden City. What the? We visited pretty much every major, every major thing in the center of China, except the Terracotta Army. I really wanted to see that one, and we just didn't get to. Got him. <laughs> All right. This looks pretty difficult to deal with now. I'm not sure what his deck is. Got the little gnome guy. What would he what would he buff that with that would make it worth taking? I don't know. Let's see. Will he do it now? Oh, okay. That seems like it's just an awful deck. We got heals for days now. Are these three each? <laughs> yes. I don't see this guy winning. Because his gnome does four damage. So even if he had charge, he would kill himself on this. I think this one's a pretty easy victory for us. Good good work, team. Lover land. Oh yeah, and I broke 50 subs. That's pretty sweet. So thank, thank you everyone out there who subscribed to me. I think we're at 57 subscribers now. Um, that's amazing. It's going really quick. And I'm hoping to make 100 before the end of next month. So, 100 by... What's next month? April? That's the goal. And now they're going to heal. What? Is it the start of my turn or the end? Oh, the start. But yeah, 56... 57 subs. That's pretty crazy. Almost back to where I was when I very... 
first started my channel maybe six years ago. I used to make Call of Duty videos, and then something happened. I stopped making them. I ended up deleting the channel. Here we are with Loverfella version number two. Definitely growing a lot quicker though with this one. My arc video, especially my extinction one, I think that got up to like 5,500 views. So that one's a pretty big hit. Alright, this is going to be a nice, clean, easy win. So, you know, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Nothing too interesting really happened today in it. Um, didn't get our Yog, Yog combo, but we did see some cool decks out there. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Check out my Patreon page. Leave a donation. You want to give me your money, and I want to take your money, so it works out very well. That's probably the... Probably not the right way to get you to donate, but go ahead and check it out. Thanks for watching.